guys welcome back to another video this is your girl Ltiana MUA and I'm coming to you guys with another so, wig review. I feel like I got a pretty decent response on my very first wig review and you guys probably don't know because I haven't been on YouTube very long but I am a wig girl um usually if I don't have my hair like in a turban I just have it braided in up under a wig so I have quite a few wigs and I have more on the way um i either make my wigs or i purchase them so i have quite a few to review and i thought hey let me go ahead and show you guys how i wear wigs and just kind of let you see what it looks like on a person with quite a large head so, this is the alexis wig from vela vela i do have the stock card for you it looks like this this is the Bella Bella Alexis. I have her in the color. So this is Alexis in the color RM Burgundy. And I saw my girl um, Natural Joy 86 um, wear this color wig a while back. And that is what made me purchase this wig. It was cute. It was red. It was something cute for the summer and spring where I don't have to have long hairs on my neck. Um, so, I purchased this wig from my local beauty supply store for $24.99. I know that you can find this wig on like wigtypes.com, uh, samsbeauty.com, and like a couple other websites. I'm pretty sure that you can find this wig there and I will leave you guys links below so you can check that so out. Far. Um, haven't experienced any shedding, haven't experienced any tangling. It is a short unit, so chances are you won't get a whole lot of that. And um, again, like I said, it is big hair friendly. Now, I am going to give you guys a 360 view of this wig, but let me just warn you, if you have a big head like I do, um, in the back, you will be able to see where my hairline exceeds the hairline of the wig on the sides, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, so, that is not a con for me because it's not the wig's fault that my head is pretty big. But, just letting you know, if you don't like that, um, you, this wig probably won't be for you. Or, if you feel like, you know, your head is too big, this probably won't be for you. But, that's okay. Like, I don't mind it. It's not too bad. So, let me go ahead and show you. start with the left side of the wig. Go ahead and turn around in the back for you guys. And pay attention to the sides where I sit. Right here, you can kind of see where my hair is sticking out on the sides of it. But it does lay very, very flat. And then this is going to be the right side of the wig. And you guys, this is just fresh out of the pack. I haven't really done anything to it. I haven't cut it at all. I haven't shaped it. I don't really need to. Um, there's not a lot of excess hair for me, so it's more just like a bang. I have it over to my left side right now, but I will show you how I style it on the right side. And typically, I like my hair styled on the right, but I thought it was kind of cute on the left. So I'm just going to use my mirror right here. Kind of look and see what I'm doing. Um... Super, super cute. Uh, it does fit snug on my head, but it's not to the point where it gives me a headache or that it's uncomfortable. I can wear this and I don't get like a headache. Because sometimes if your wig is too tight, you definitely going to have a headache. It's a given. So you don't want to do that. So like I said, my head's pretty big. I don't get a headache with it. I probably should have some earrings on. It look a little bit different for you guys. But here it is over to the right. As you can see, it's very, very, very pretty. And this side. It's just this part right here where, like I said, my hair sticks out on the side. But other than that, I have no complaints about this wig. If you guys like these type of videos, if you like these wig reviews and you kind of want to see me do more or show you more of my collection, definitely thumbs up this video. Let me know that I should keep doing these videos for you guys because I love to. They're quick and 
straight to the point. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share my videos. And if you want to see more, like I said, definitely leave me a comment down below or just thumbs up this video so that I know to keep making videos like this. So until next time, bye guys.